The overall goal of this procedure is to test the effect of attentional blink on non-target words in a sequence. This is accomplished by first setting up an experimental paradigm with rapid serial visual presentations of eight words each. The second step is to instruct participants to attend to both the target word that belongs to a certain category as well as other non-target words. Next, test for the detection of the target in the sequence by giving them two seconds to respond yes or no. The final step is to test memory for non-target words by delivering a two-second alternative force choice task. Ultimately, this novel dual task procedure uses an attentional blink paradigm to show the temporal effects of attentional blink on non-target words. This method can help answer key questions in the cognitive neuroscience field, such as how attention affects both the temporal and spatial ability to process other stimuli or events in addition to the detection target. To begin, choose at least seven different categories from Batik and Montag's category norms for verbal items to use in the target detection task. Next, choose nouns from these categories to use as targets as well as other words from separate categories to use as decoys. Make sure the set is large enough so that the same target is not used repeatedly during testing. Choose non-target and distractor nouns from the Penn Tree Bank corpus.